we applied for a grant to help us put a meeting together, a meeting that happened to be international. I wanted to go somewhere and learn more about laparoscopic sacral copalpexy was my main objective. How do our colleagues from far away, Europe, uh, do things? You can read about it, you can uh, listen to it on YouTube or whatever, but there's nothing like having a group of individuals able to see eye to eye, discuss on an open floor uh, intricacies of, in our case, surgical techniques. It's a procedure that I've done for the last 15 years open. <clears throat> I'm feeling really comfortable with the procedure open and that's all I can offer to my patients is the open approach. <clears throat> but I was feeling comfortable enough with the procedure that I said, you know, I think I'm ready to try this laparoscopically. However, I really needed to spend some time with somebody who's already doing it laparoscopically and to sort of find out what equipment do I need, what skill set do I need, um, how can I bring this procedure back to my center. It was voice in our group to be able to exchange with colleagues that practice in a different environment ideas uh, and, uh, and knowledge on very specific field and it was so specific that it's very difficult to get funding from the usual sources. Because it was going to be involve, involve some travel costs, I took my family with me, so it was going to be quite costly. So I applied to the Royal Colleges for some funding to sort of help offset some of those costs. Um, I applied to the Royal College and um, was successful at one of their CPD grants, and it, it definitely helped. Well, I'd certainly recommend our fellows to apply for this kind of grant. There's various reasons, but the first reason is it helps you better organize your meeting because there are guidelines that are required to, uh, to ensure that the, that the, uh, the granting agency uh, knows that the meeting will be appropriate, the, uh, the meeting, the, the, the educational activity will be appropriate. It also um, helps you put your, uh, your activity at a, at a higher level of recognition. I mean, you literally can use the Royal College stamp.